A rapturous welcome for Johnny Depp and his new film, Jeanne de Barry, which opened the Cannes Film Festival. The true tale of a working class woman who uses her beauty to climb the social ladder until she reaches King Louis XV and falls in love, but causes scandal in the court. It's the story of a free woman ignoring social codes, shot in the Palace of Versailles, an opulent historical drama. Sitting down with Al Jazeera, Depp said after two high-profile trials, the film came at a perfect time for him, and he could relate to the scrutiny endured by his character. From the, my experiences in, 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 in that kind of, living that kind of complex life, I can only imagine for a king, I mean, Louis Cairns, that, the, that his, uh, pr the pressures, I'm afraid to watch me. I'm afraid to shave in the morning because I have to look at myself. <laughs> so uh, I haven't seen the film yet. But many in France have. The film was simultaneously screened across hundreds of cinemas, though some believe it was a controversial choice. Star Johnny Depp has obviously had his own issues with the law and also My Wen, the director, has recently had accusations against her. And, you know, she herself, um, she married Luc Besson very young. Um, I wouldn't say she's necessarily engaged with feminism. People have called her anti Me Too. Mai Wen, who spent seven years working on the project, draws a number of parallels with her character. I fell in love with Jeanne's temperament, her story and her trajectory. Maybe because it was a love story that was highly criticised, where she was insulted. Maybe because I lived a love story too, which was criticised. I wanted to defend this, to defend the idea that love can exist between a powerful man and a woman of lower social class. It revolts me that even today we still think that a woman who comes from a poor background, if she's with a man of power, is there for self-interest. Cannes has often courted controversy, but festival director Thierry Frémaux says he has one rule when selecting films. Do they demonstrate freedom of thinking, freedom of speech, and do they act within a legal framework, leaving audiences to decide whether they can separate the art from the artist? Charlie Angela Al Jazeera, Cannes. Football now, and Manchester City will play into.